what is the value of x? Let's tackle statement one first. 4x plus 4 equals 0, so we could say 4x equals negative 4, and x equals negative 1. Well, that's the value of x right there, so this one's sufficient. We get rid of uh, 2 and c and e. <laughs> B, C, and E, or 1, or uh, 2, 3, and 5. I don't know why I switched from uh, numbers to letters. Anyway, statement 2 looks like it's going to be the tricky one. We have x plus 2 quantity squared equals x squared. I think we can multiply this guy out, though, and it's going to make life easier because the first term is going to be x squared, so we can actually, we're going to be able to subtract some stuff. So this ends up being x squared plus uh, 4x plus 4 equals x squared. Subtract 4 subtract an x squared from both sides, we get 4x plus 4 equals 0, which, if you've been following along at home, might look familiar. Uh, this is actually the same thing that statement 1 told us and would have the same solution, x equals negative 1. And since statement 1 is sufficient, and this tells us the same thing, statement 2 also sufficient, answer choice D, either one on its own, good enough for us.